Hey everybody, welcome back to Minecraft Story Mode. So, the last time we paused the episode, uh, what's her face? I don't even remember her name because they haven't said it in a while. Uh, just noticed something on the ceiling. So, let's see what she saw. Is this a maze? It would appear so. A massive one from the looks of it. Oh man, that's too cool. If Ivor used the command block to build this, it could hold unspeakable peril. Why do I sense that entering this so-called maze would be a grave mistake? Because some part of you still knows Ivor. Unfortunately, this seems to be the only way forward. There has to be another way. A secret door, or I don't know, some way around. There's no way we're going into some crazy maze that I were built to keep people away. We'll find some other way through. Best decision you've made all day. Yeah. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, I was hoping that they would be like, oh. The maze is just, I don't want to look in there yet. I know there are flowers. Ah, I should have went in the maze. That would have been way more interesting. I hope it's like we have no choice. Glad I wasn't standing here when this fell. Ah, oh, yeah, that's right. Well, I don't want to climb yet. Let me look at the flowers. Flowers, but no trees. Guess it's a farlands thing. Hmm. I didn't know flowers grew exclusively around trees. Look at the broken wall. Ivor needs to take better care of this place. Maybe that's by design. I thought you weren't gonna go in there. Yeah, good point. Ah! Uh, ah! Uh. Alright, whatever. Spoiled sport. Ugh. I know, they're gonna allow us to climb up. I know. <sighs> Whatever. Huh. You can probably climb these. Everyone, on guard! There's too many! We can't fight them all! Oh, wow. Where's my sword? What? What am I? What am I doing? Oh, yeah, climb. Guys! Climb the vines! Ha! She's so strong! Not only does it take a lot to hold a pig, but to also pull yourself up by one arm? She's a beast! Well, that worked, I suppose. Yeah, I guess. But now what do we do? We're all separated. Let's just head that way and find a place where the pads connect. Sure hope they don't get lost in there. Man. I hope I don't get lost in there. I'm following my instincts. I'm following my instincts as far as this game is concerned. Like, this is the... This is the natural reaction that I would have to this. And this is the natural reaction that I would have to that. But, oh, it makes me regret it sometimes. Because it's like, oh, either choice I would have made would have been cool. Uh, let's walk faster. Oh, well, well then. All right. Oh, man. <clears throat> There's something I was going to talk to you guys about. I don't know what it was. Some kind of pressing issue. I can't remember. Uh, I hear his footy steps. Wait. Oh, so this is like a maze for real, for real. Well, then. I did. Okay, I didn't see that part. Hey, let's walk through. Uh, man, that thing is so... It sucks. I understand that this is a game about perspective. But I kind of wish... That this was like a hey, what's this? A waterfall. Yeah, listen. I first met Ruben near a waterfall like this. Hope 
the little guy's okay. Oh, did you really? So you found your pig in the wild, and he just so happened to follow you for the rest of your days? Wasn't that nice? Wasn't that just nice? Are you going to have any other trips down memory lane? No, I'm glad... Oh. Ivor's cottage. Hey, that must be Ivor's lab. Wish it was a little closer. No, it's not his lab. That's his cottage, thank you. I will continue to thank you to call it by its proper name. Maybe he has some cookies to replace all that cake that I didn't take. Am I going the right way? I am inadvertently making the proper decisions. Not because I want to, because my gamer instinct is just that good. What is this? Floating Iceland. It's technically not floating. Okay, it's got a bottom and a top support. I think it's safe to say the far lands are strange. Yeah, it's not floating in midair. It's not using Minecraft physics and just floating in midair, which is something that I think is awesome. Broken Hills? Yeah, I mean, excuse me, that's what I was saying. Oh, imagine walking through this place. It'd be freaking awesome. Um, but I would personally think that walking over the top of it is just as cool. Because not only do I get to see everything, but I'm out of harm's way. And that's what I was saying before. I wish this was, uh, had better perspectives where I could like rotate the camera 360 degrees, look up and look down and really fully appreciate everything that's going on. Um... I, I keep going this way. It would suck if I came all this way and the game was like, uh, oh, no, uh, sorry, guy. You chose the wrong way initially, so now you're not going to get anywhere. You got to go all the way back. and be like, uh, oh, balls. See, now this is more of a floating island. I keep for, yeah, what is this? Floating island, yes, the real floating island. It's not supported by anything. This place just gets weirder and weirder. No, that should let you know that there are different... If I was a Minecraft scientist, this place would be absolutely fascinating. I would... Yikes! I hate spiders! Yeah. Shoot! Oh. You have got to be kidding me. There goes my mighty blade. Dang it. Dang it. Ugh. I hate spiders. And I don't... I don't know what I'd do in a world where spiders were really that large. Like, that would freak me the hell out. Way too much. Am I inadvertently choosing the right way to go again? Again. Yes. Oh! Dragon Ball Z Super is out and it is freaking fantastic. I love it. 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 Oh, it's. Hey! Olivia! <laughs> oh, balls. Huh. You witch. Hey, you witch! Yeah, yeah. Ah. Oh. Who? Oh my gosh. I didn't know that there were witches in here. But Dragon Ball Super has been an absolute pleasure because I don't know if I've talked about this on the show before, but Dragon Ball Z is one of my favorite cartoons. Top I would venture to say yeah, Dragon Ball Z is like my number one favorite cartoon of all time. I love Dragon Ball Z. It's just good. It's sheer adrenaline and testosterone. Yes, they did have episodes where, or they did have things that happened in it where it's like, it takes me 18 episodes to power up all the way. Now, see, this is another true floating island. Here, you can clearly see it's not supported by anything. A literal turd nugget floating in the air. <laughs> Lovely, it's waxing poetic. 
at least you're accepting it. You know, if I was a physicist, I would love to come to a place like this and see everything that was possible and try to replicate it in the real world. That's the thought that I had before, and I finally completed it. Um, but Dragon Ball Z, huh? What's that? Don't, 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 don't. It's a mimic. It's a mimic. Uh, what is this? Redstone machine. Redstone machine. Oh, well, I wouldn't look at the chasm. That's not going to progress anything. It's nice. I don't see a way across. Yeah, I've always got that place locked up pretty tight. See what item I get? Please give me a diamond sword. Looks like Ivor kept some redstone dust handy. And a slime ball. Okay. Sure, they had things that was like, oh my goodness, it, Vegeta will be forever powering up. And then like two weeks later, he finally finishes and they get into the fight and the fight only lasts like one episode. But, you know, Huh, redstone blocks, some pistons. Wonder what this thing's supposed it's to be. It's supposed to launch you. Hello? Anyone? Olivia, is that you? Jesse, there you are. <laughs> Where's the other two? I thought I'd never find you. All those dead ends back there. Am I glad to see you guys? Uh. Us two. Uh. I thought Reuben and I would be lost in here forever. <laughs> uh. This maze? We don't have time for I this. Her. Who even knows where the others are by now? <laughs> I mean, the clock's ticking here, Jesse. Yet we're lost in some elaborate puzzle. Well, at least we're back together. Yes, the dream team reunited. Yeah, Olivia. <laughs> now the dream team's just got to find a way across this gaping bottomless pit. It's going to launch us. What about this thing? Could it get us across? It's some kind of flying barge. It would probably get us to the other side. But it's in really bad shape. And it's really complicated. Mm. You can fix it though, right? I don't know. I think it's out of my league. What? I wish I'd had more time to study with Eligard. Come on, you'll figure it out. You know you always do. <sighs> Fine. Yeah. I'll take a look. Thank you. This layout doesn't even make any sense. What was Ivor thinking? Or maybe it's just me. I mean, Eligard herself said I don't have what it takes to be a great engineer. She was right. I just can't hack it. I might as well be a carrot farm. Eligard didn't know you, not the way I do. But Jesse, she's the greatest redstone engineer ever. Mm. She's in the Order of the Stone. Sure, but the Order are still people, just like Dang us. Dang right. Right, just like us. I mean, how are we the ones saving the world when even they don't have what it takes? Soren and Ivor are always at each other's throats. The greatest warrior in history doesn't remember his own name None of them give Eligard any respect, and Magnus lost his life trying to fight this. Hmm. If the Order can't do this, how are we supposed to? We've come this far already. How are we supposed to do anything? We're nobody. All I know is the world is depending on us. And maybe the world is in trouble. I mean... They defeated an Ender Dragon. Can you name even one thing we've done right? And I don't mean managing to stay alive. Something that actually matters. Well, for starters, we made it to the Far Lands. And we're stuck here. Yeah, but we could have been stuck anywhere else along the way. Instead, we fought and figured things out. And look how far we've That's come. Right. I like that way of looking at it. That's right. Ah, uh, all right. I'll try it one more time. There you go. Probably 
Ross. Wait a second. I think I see what he was trying to do. Jesse, take this piston, craft it into a sticky piston, then place it on the other side of the barge, along with a redstone block. You got all that? I think so. Okay, so sticky piston and redstone block. So I'm use. Okay, so. The sooner the better. Shut up, please. Thank you. Jeez, man. So rude. Yeah, so rude. Ah, I thought it was going to be like real Minecraft where I could just quickly go around without him having to do the arm animation. Nah, that's fine. Okay, Tango. a redstone block. All right, now. Okay, let's put the redstone block where it's supposed to go and place these pistons. Uh, stick piston, place. Redstone block, place. I don't think I had anything else that I could craft into like a sword or anything. Holy cow, we did it! We need flint and steel to get it started. I'm proud of you, Olivia. Thanks, Jesse. And thanks for everything you said just before. It really Darn helped. Darn right. No problemo. Can I get another hug? Oh, just high five. Okay. It must be this way! Run! Everybody get on! Quick, onto the barge! How... how did you get separate? Never mind. You splint and steal. Take a cha! Take a cha! Take a cha! Oh! Get, get on! Jesse! J -j -j -go, go, go! Go! Okay. Wait, what? That was close. Everyone okay? For the moment. How is this? I remember something. Didn't Eligard build a machine like this once? Yes, in the nether. <clears throat> and you were terrified of flying on it. What? Stuff and nonsense. <laughs> is that true? Soren, is that true? Of course not. Ah. <laughs> well, I suppose I might be mistaken. Mm, I liked you better when you had amnesia. <laughs> How did that... How did that work? And good job on getting your memories back, dude. Well, that was exciting. Uh, by exciting, I assume you mean absurd and unnecessary. Let's go see what he's hiding. Oh, shut up. No, not, not you, Jesse. Soren. Jeez, man. A little testicular fortitude. Just a little bit. Even though people who are afraid of heights, that is a very valid and reasonable fear to have. Um, and it's a very valid and reasonable apprehension so to have. many books. We should be careful. This place could be booby-trapped. Yeah. Let's just yeah. start looking for the yeah. enchanting book. I'm not going to make the easy joke. Even though it seems odd, excuse me, oddly appropriate. Given the fact that we had a, a bro hug... Glad, glad you had a bro hug. Okay. Did, what the, oh, okay. There we go. Uh, for some reason, the axis is inverted in my mind, and I was like... How to train your slime. The various uses of mushroom stew? Potionology, volume 24? None of these are enchanting books. Oh. The Immaculate World of Ass, Volume 59. Brief history of Cubism. Crafting for Noobs, Revised. A Collector's Guide to Precious Gems. Dating for Dummies. These seem to be enchanting books either. How to Attract Your Soulmate. My God, what was he researching here? Olivia. Olivia, any luck? Not really. Ivor has too many books, and there's too few of us looking. How did we end up all split up like this? I feel like we're spreading ourselves too thin. I miss how things used to be. 
That first night we all spent together? Look, we might be spread thin, but we're all still a team. That's how teams work. Hey, you almost said teamwork. <laughs> See, we're still funny. We can still get things done. I guess being split up just means we can be in more places at once, right? right? Kinda like the wither storm. Let's just forget that metaphor. Yeah. I think it's for the best. Okay, let's uh, see what's going on here. I would love, I would love to have a library like this. Oh gosh, I just gave myself goosebumps and chills thinking about, oh, uh, thinking about my library, thinking about the library that I want to have. But okay, I, I'm going to cut the video here. Um, thank you so much for joining me. When we return, I will tell you about my ideal study that I want because yeah, I'm sure you all would love to hear about that. But thank you so much for joining me. If you liked it, mash that like button like there's no tomorrow. Share the video with the world. Yeah, I said that right. Hit me up on Twitter. Hit me up in the comment section below. Let me know what you think about the videos thus far. And I am the outlier and I will see you all in the next video.